All right. Good night, everybody. It's been a pleasure to have you back. Hey, good night, guys. Good we night. have Cody. We have Elsie. We have Elwin Pineda. Hey, Elwin. Hey, we missed you yesterday, right? I apologize for not being in class yesterday. Uh -huh. You got to give me a good reason why not. <laughs> I, I feel bad about my health. Oh, okay. So that's a good one. The, the doctor diagnosed me with uh, enteritis. Ooh, really? But, uh. Yeah, but after taking the medicine, uh -huh. he prescribed me, I feel much better. You f Now you feel much better. It yes. is like um, something regarding your stomach. Hi. Yeah, exactly. I, 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 you see too much fried fish. <laughs> probably. Uh, probably right you wish right you wish with the, oh that's but we missed you yesterday uh, okay really missed you well in my case i miss you i don't know about your classmates but i do i i do miss you and you look so fresh today <laughs> is it hot where you the live weather is very hot it's very hot yes imagine you that you live there and you're supposed to get used to it imagine me no way Wow, how many degrees? Maybe 31, 32. But that, that is not hot. No, I think more. More, <laughs> probably yes, more. Probably more, yeah, yeah. Because if you like have a t-shirt like that, like, oof, it's because it's, <laughs> it's really hot. But you already took a shower. Yes. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. No, I'm just wondering. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just teasing you. I just, I'm just so happy that you feel much better today no, and uh, you. you're here with us. Because you know what? Yesterday, uh, I think it was Jaime. I don't know. No, Jaime is not in the class. I don't know. Yes, I think so. Because I got confused. I got confused with these two guys. I don't know why. But uh, yesterday was only one man in class and it was just ladies night. So oh. he said, oh my God, he said, it's going to be just me. And I said, lucky you, man. You're blessed, surrounded around this all beautiful ladies. But then another Paul appears and he said, phew. Thanks God it was not only me. But right now, Elwin, you're the lucky man. Because you are surrounded by all these beautiful girls. You see, we have Ceci, we have Liz, we have Elsie, we have Pame. So that's good. Right, Ceci? Yes, right. Are you see? <laughs> of course. <laughs> hey, you got, hey, guys, uh, tell me something. Let's listen to Elwin. Elwin, you didn't, uh, you were not here yesterday. And just we were talking about what we had done um weekend so we want to hear you what did you do on this last weekend on saturday and sunday uh, this weekend uh, i worked you worked yeah the whole day yeah oh my goodness really uh, what is exactly the day that you have off uh, i'm not uh, exactly one day specifically Okay, so it's changed every week? Yes. Oh. And you only have one or two? Uh, one and a half. One and a half. Why is one and a half? I don't get it. Uh, one day mm -hmm. and a half day. Really? Yes. This is the first time that I hear that. What about you, girls? Is 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 supposedly normally it's just one or two, but one and a half. Yes, one and a half. Okay, <laughs> that's the first <laughs> time you see. That's the first sign. What about you, SSE and Liz? Is the first time that you hear that you have one and a half day off, or no? It's common yes. for you. No, for me, no. Oh, it's the first time. Uh, it's the first here. time, right? You see, right. first time. Yeah, one and a half. But maybe, so for example, uh, uh -huh. Saturday I only work four hours. Mm -hmm. Ah, only yes. like in the morning, right? For example, exactly. Ah, uh -huh. uh, okay, I got it. But I wish I could have two instead of one and a half. 
right? No, but that's okay if you have one and a half. That's amazing. As long as you have vacation, right? Because there are some uh, guys and there are some people that they don't have day off, right? They work like from Monday to Sunday. Oh my goodness, no way. Mm -mm. And we I think that yes, he, he refers about a uh, one and a half and a half, uh, maybe one normal day mm -hmm. and the other day is only a uh, half. <laughs> Uh huh. Yes. Now I understood. <laughs> yeah, I think so. but that's good. At least he has a Sunday to rest, right? Yeah, that's cool. That's awesome. Hey, Elwin, when are you planning to come to San Salvador? No. Come on, Elwin. You're supposed to visit us in Les Corporativo. Come on. Ah, you see, Jaime is here. Someday, someday. <laughs> someday. When you get your diploma, right? You sh when you get to the diploma, you got to be here. Do you get me a physical diploma? Yes, you will have it. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, have you seen by any chance the status of my WhatsApp that I put like a day before? No? Ash. Uh, yeah, we put some guys with the physical diploma holding. Yes. So you will get it. And I want to see you because uh, maybe there will be the, the only day that I can meet you in person, guys. That would be nice. Oh, yes. I, when? Want, I, I don't know, but when you finish. <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> ah, okay. Yeah, it will be the only time. Hopefully it's going to be Saturday. Because I'm the, uh, Saturday is the only time that I can be there. Yeah, but I want to meet you guys physically. Hopefully one day, right? Hopefully. That would be nice. That would be awesome. Hey, guys, talking about changes and everything. Uh, today I received a call. Uh, uh, of the government got call regarding the, the second shot. I think, yeah, because uh, my second doses... I was supposed to have it by the, September the 16th, but I think it because due to the circumstances, they like, uh, they like put it one, I think one month behind, no, one month before. Yeah, and I, I did reschedule my one. I think I'm gonna have it by August the 19th. Is it, is it AstraZeneca? Well, yeah, that's the one that they shot me. And yeah, me too. They call me. Yeah, you, they call you, Elsie. Yes, oh. they call. Me. Yeah, and and, and, and they reschedule it, right? Yes, reschedule. Oh, okay. Well, the first shot, nothing happens to me. Only that I wasn't sleeping like a bird. <laughs> yeah. Look at I, you. <laughs> I, yes, I, I was scary because, like, because uh, you know, I have a hypertension. I am a hyper person. I have a hypertension plug or blood pressure and I have sinus problems. So that is part of allergy, right? So I said, oh my God, please. I don't care if I have gastro problems, if I have a sore muscles, but please, I don't want, I don't want to have headache because, oh my God, that's worse because when I have headache, it combines with a sinus and I want to like take out my head because it hurts a lot but but no nothing happens i said okay well i pray first and then i said okay let's go let's go let's give it a shot and uh, basically you know what happened to me is i just wanted to sleep and to eat that's it but two days two days in a row i was like laying on bed wake up to get to have breakfast going back to bed wake up to have lunch going back to bed <laughs> can you imagine wake up to have my break in the afternoon like a cup of coffee and a sweet, and a sweet bread going back to bed <laughs> and then wake up for dinner can you imagine and i That's was like the life that i want yes Pame. <laughs> but for me I, I, I was thinking maybe because this month this month have been really tough you see because working from monday to friday and uh, giving classes at night sometimes i have to go back to bed around midnight for example so maybe i have like a little um 
I don't know, maybe I'm tired and, and that tiredness is accumulated. So maybe I need to rest, I said. But you know what? It's too much because I felt really, really lazy. Like I don't want to do anything. Yes. And for me, it was nice because I, I was wondering if I sleep at afternoon, I won't be able to sleep at night. Nah, -uh. no way. I sleep in the morning. I sleep in the afternoon. I sleep at night like a baby. My husband is like, what happened to this lady? Like, hmm? and it was two days in a row, two consecutive days after the shot. I got the shot. I think I, it was on, on Thursday, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, on Thursday. And then that same Thursday, right, the whole day. And then the fr Friday, again. And, and then on Saturday, I felt with a little bit more energy. But that was awesome. I don't know about you guys, but for me, it was great. Because if not of that, I, I'm, I won't have like a time for me to rest. Because right now, I'm a person who has a lot of things to do, who does a lot of things. And I'm, I'm, I'm a hyper person. I'm like this, right? Like a Red Bull. <laughs> so if it's not for the shot, I won't have like time for me to rest and to recover myself. So for, my, for me, it was nice. But I don't know if it's going to be in a AstraZeneca again or Pfizer. I don't have any idea. What about you guys? How was your experience? I don't, I don't feel anything. You didn't feel anything, Elsie? That's no. Cool. Excellent. Teacher, how do you say dormilona? Lazy. <laughs> or oh, <a> sleepy person. <laughs> and you know what? It's sleeping Sorry? beauty. <laughs> La bella durmiente. <laughs> sleeping beauty. Oh. Remember that? Remember that mm -hmm. yeah. story tale? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So you are like I am a sleepy very, beauty. very sleepy. Ah, you are like a bird. Yeah. Okay, that's good. Yeah. Me too. <laughs> I love to sleep. The problem is that we don't have time, right, guys? Sometimes we don't have time. Because yes. there's a lot of things that we gotta do. What about you, yes. Lisette? This uh, that happens to you or no? Uh, yes, yeah. I had the first shot in what this month. This month, the, okay. Yes, in I will have the second shot in Thursday, two days. Or, really? or uh, really? tomorrow, past tomorrow. <laughs> really? Yes. So this because month I, you had the they, first shot, and then yes. in two days you will have the second shot. Okay. Yes, because they put me five fast Pfizer. 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 Uh -huh. Pfizer. But uh -huh. I felt the my arm hurt oh, a your lot. Arm. Really? Uh, yes, and I felt sleepy. Hungry, uh -huh, and, you see. Uh -huh. and um, my my body, uh -huh. uh, I feel like like I don't know how to say. Do your mm, best. <laughs> tired or tired? I yeah. don't know how to say. Cansada. Say tired. I have a very tired. tired. Uh, very tired. Very but tired. That was just the first day. The second ah. day. I was better. You, you felt better. Yeah. So it was okay. So very good because most of the people, you know what my boss, is, she, she asked me what type of shot that you got. And, and I said AstraZeneca, right? And she said, but she, her, I don't know what happened. I don't know, is maybe her uh, immune system. I don't know. Well, depends on the person, right? But she, she passed her really bad. She had all the symptoms. And it was like, and she's younger than me. Like, no kidding, Andrita. Yeah. Oh, no, you cannot imagine. Lucky you, she said. So hopefully nothing happens to her the second shot. Yeah. And you know what? We got the, sh the shot in the same day. But she will have it in a different place. And I will have it here in, um, um, how you say that? Folks, alude? San Jacinto? Yeah? That one is fast. Less than an mm. hour, I was out. So hopefully it will be the same. Mm. 
And it, why is everybody quiet? What happened with the energy? It's not Monday, it's Tuesday. Come on. <laughs> okay, guys. That's why, that's why, because that, it's Tuesday. Is, when it's supposed to be Monday, Pami? <laughs> yeah. So what happened? Yeah. So you're supposed to have like more energy right now, than Monday, right? It's raining. It's, it's, ah. it's because... And I can uh, listen very well. Ah. What about um, you, Pami? What is your reason? Tell me. Um, I am changing of, of work. Pajamas? No. Ah. no. <laughs> I'm changing work. Ah, okay. Yeah. So I was uh, preparing all things. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so that's why that's why I'm so sorry no that's okay no problem but i'm happy that you're here beatriz is here as well blanky claudia de enriquez we have luis bonilla gabby sanchez good night, Josue, good night. and we have lisette sarakai sarakai hopefully I pronounce it correctly sarakai okay cool guys do you remember what we have seen yesterday yes. yeah you get a question very good. Indirect, uh, indirect question with what? With WH, right? Yeah. With WH, with B, we do, and we can. Is that right? Yes, it's right. Okay, cool. All right. So I remember because a teacher, I don't have a good memory, but in case of my homeworks, I do. So, <laughs> hey, guys, I left a homework, right? <laughs> And I miss like, <laughs> yes, I, she never forgets that. No. Uh -uh. So do you remember what was the hunger about? I think uh, it was like some sentences, right? That it was like a direct way and you got to like transform it into indirect way. Am I correct? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So very good. So you know what? We're going to play the game. Um. I want, I'm going to think about a number between one and, uh, and 12. Can I have one number between one and 12, Josue? Josue, Josue, where is my man, Josue? Josue, hello, hello. hello. I'm, I'm sorry. Is it me you're looking for? Yeah. <laughs> Because I see you in your eyes. Well, I cannot see you, but I imagine in your eyes because I cannot see your, your face right now, right? Okay. <laughs> so, Josue, how are you? I'm fine. Yeah, that's that's amazing. So, give me a number between 1 and 12, please. Um, I, I, I was not here. Don't yesterday. worry. Just give me one number. <laughs> ah, one number. Uh-huh. One number between one and twelve. One and twelve. Okay, uh, twelve. Nah, you're lucky. <laughs> Don't worry. Very good. Okay, what about you, Claudia Enriquez? Uh, eight. No, but close. <laughs> uh, <laughs> phew, right. Uh, what about you, uh, Ceci? Mm, uh, seven. Oh my God! Yes, that's the one. Woo you're the lucky girl for today, girl. Yeah, isn't it amazing? Of course it is. Very good. So this, I'm gonna share right now my screen, so I know that Jose was not here. Also, Elwin, but doesn't. Don't worry, okay? Because we're going to recap what we have seen yesterday. That's why I start this class with um homework. So let me just a couple of minutes. And there you go. Hey, can you see it, guys? Yeah, right? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay, cool. Just a recap, just for the people that was not here yesterday. We saw the Android question with WH, with B, with do, and we can. Here is the regular way how we say it. And here is the way that we said it with the Android one. Remember, guys, that yeah, with Andrek, we use it to express things more polite. Is that right? Yes. Yeah. That's right. Okay, cool. And we can use, could you tell me, do you know, in regards to B? But 
do you remember guys that normally the verb to be goes in the regular way that we ask questions after the wh but what happened when i transform a wh question into an indirect question what happened with that verb to be do you remember it goes at the end of the exactly it goes at the end of the sentence so that is one thing that we gotta remember okay cool what about the one with do do you remember that we use the auxiliary do or does is that right okay so if it's like a plural the only thing that we gotta use is just to add can you tell me and then the rest is gonna be the scene right except for remember that the question that I think was Liz or Ceci. No, it was Claudi, Claudi Enriquez, who said, what about, can I said the bus run? Yes, we can, right? But it depends if we're talking about only one route. What about this one, does? You see, that is the auxiliary. So what happened with the verb? It stays in the present. But if I, transform it into a direct question. Am I using the do or does here, guys? No, they do no. disappear. Yeah. Exactly, but since I'm not using it, what I have to do with the main verb, which in this case is opened? In plural. In plural, are you sure? No, third person. In, in third person, exactly. Because remember, bookstore is it, right? Very good. And last but not least, with can. Can I, where can I catch the bus? Okay, remember that I goes after the auxiliary, which in this case is can. However, when I transform it into indirect question, what happened with the I and the can? What happened? It switch places, right? Where I can catch the bus. You see, that is one of the main difference. So with, without, well, no, with this recap, like a really quick recap, uh, just one guys, so you can tell me how, well, what you have done in this homework. Don't worry, okay? Do or tell me what you have done. Don't worry if it's wrong or right. That's why we are here and we're gonna to collaborate each, uh, between us, okay? Oh, there you go. Okay, guys, the first one, um, how much the bus cost? May I ask you, do you uh -huh. think, guys, we're going to use this one, this one, or this one? What do you think? Which of the three we need to use to convert this first one? How much the bus costs? Which one? The second, the second one. one. Exactly. WS questions we do. Why? Oh, well, simply because we have this one here, right? There you go. So you gotta use this one. In this case, this one. Uh-huh. Who can give me the underway way for the first question? Go ahead, Jaime. Thank you. Okay. Do you know how much the bus cost? Cost or costs? Uh, cost. Cost. With S at the end. Uh huh. The pronunciation is quite, uh, it is a little bit hard because most of the time the people that does not mention the S. Hey guys, do you remember that I sent you like a link, right? So you can like uh, practice the three uh, accents, the UK one, the Australia one, and the British one. So she gave one example, right? Yes. And that, that like, uh, it was like uh, ships, ships, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's exactly the same way, Jaime. Casts. Uh-huh. Thanks God I'm not in front. If not, it will be like Silvestre. <laughs> <laughs> All righty, Julio. Welcome to the tango, my friend. Sorry, welcome to the class. <laughs> Excellent. Okay. So let's go back to business, okay? Let's move on, let's go back. Very good, Jaime, congratulations. It's exactly the, very good. Just repeat for me the question, please, in the indirect way, if you don't mind, the pronunciation. 
the number one again? Yes, yes, please. I just want to hear the pronunciation one more time. Okay. Do you know how much the bus costs? Excellent. Very good. Now I hear the S. I mean, I have to let you know that 10 years in a call center, my ear is really developed. So if in Spanish, it's like, tengo ido de tisico, right? I can so, see that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So that's the reason why I'm asking you. But very good. Thank you so much. Good job, sir. Number two, where's the nearest internet cafe? Uh, what about you, um, Claudita de Enriquez? What do you have with that one? Uh, could you tell me where the nearest internet is? Very good. Excellent. So it's got to be the first one, right? Would be. Yeah. Very good. Why? Because we have here that contraction way. Okay. Excellent job. Good job. All right. What about number three, Liz? Uh huh, Liz. What uh, time do the banks open? Okay. Can you tell me what time the banks open? Very good. Excellent. So it's got to be the, this one, right? But the yes. first example. Very yes. good. Excellent. Number four. How late do the buses run? Uh, Ceci. Mm, uh, do you know how late uh, the buses run? Very good. Fantastic. Very good job. Oh, let me see who else, who else, who else. Blanquita, are you ready? Where can I get a quick meal? Where can I get a quick meal? Mm -hmm. Uh, number five. Yes, number five, please, Blanky. Okay. Uh, do you know where I can get a, a quick meal? Very good. Congratulations. Excellent job. Number six. Let me see who's going to give me a try on this one. Uh, 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 uh. Elsie. <laughs> All right, Elsie. How late do the nightclub stays open? <laughs> Okay. Can you tell me how late do the nightclub site open? Very good. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. All right. Number seven. How early do the trends run? Let me check it out. Eh, 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 Gavi Sanchez. Can you tell me mm -hmm. uh, how early the trains run? Very good. And the last but not least, where is an expensive hotel in this area? So who's going to help me on this one? Let me double check. Verito, would you like me to help me on this one? Hey. Number eight. Yes, please. Where's an an expensive hotel in this area? Aha, uh -huh. now transform into a direct question. Aha, mm. uh -huh. you see? You can see do this you, one. Aha, uh -huh. do you? Do you? Aha. Uh -huh. Do you know? Aha. Uh -huh. Where? Uh, do you know where an expensive an expensive hotel in this area in this area oh, yeah. is is very good excellent good job very good job oh my mm. god guys i'm so happy that i'm going to close my eyes and you're gonna i'm gonna be in tears oh, very good you have understood excellent so guys now you know Okay, that it will be much better if you um, learn to, uh, to use that one, especially when you're asking for directions, right? Or uh, maybe give you like more information about what a specific place it is. But now that you already know about that, we will continue with this, but I'm not going to let you think. I want you to like, this is gonna be a game. I'm gonna give you, a different questions now. <laughs> that uh, is, <laughs> and Claudia and Rick is like, 
Oh my God. Sometimes I want to I wanna get inside her mind to check what is she thinking. Yes, you cannot imagine. I have a brainstorm here that you cannot imagine. It's like tornado. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, because this one um, is going to be a challenge because um, I will give you two seconds to answer. So that means that you're like quick view and then you have to give it to me. I'm going to evaluate not only the way you say it, the way you pronounce the, the, the questions, but at the same time, if you say it correctly and if you put the verb in the correct way. So if you made a mistake, like, ah, and then uh, somebody else has to do it, okay? Uh -huh. So let's do something. Um, <laughs> um for example if it's like Ceci storm for example and she she made a mistake and you said and maybe it's cloud is raising the hand and i said okay cloud is your turn like and she got it you got point okay but what happened to Ceci? you won't be able to continue participating in the game uh-huh so let's say that now it's Jaime's turn and Edwin uh, answered, but he was also wrong. Okay, don't worry about that, that's okay. But it was Jaime's turn and he couldn't answer, so he's out. But Edwin is still in the game, okay? So what we're going to do, is we, who's going to be the last one on the game and who has more points? So hopefully you have better study, you have to do your job and don't cheat, right? because it's not you're gonna get in trouble with me <laughs> don't worry i'm what i'm gonna do right now guys i'm gonna send it to you the um, the information on the whatsapp because i want to see your face uh-huh so hopefully elsie uh and gabby i can see your beautiful face and your beautiful eyes thank you Jose. finally i can see your face very good all righty, so bear with me. <laughs> are you ready, guys? Yes, right? Of course you are. Uh-huh. Okay. Um, mm -mm 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 -mm. Bear with me for a moment. There you go. I'm going to send it to you, so just let me know when you're ready. Bear with me for a moment. I will send it to you right now. Just let me know as soon as you're able to receive it, okay? There you go. Okay. It's here. Okay, cool. <laughs> okay. You have it there. You have it there. So, guys, are you guys ready? Yeah, right? Damn, I have my chronometer here. Allow me just one moment. Let me check. I'm going to hit. There you go. Okay, cool. Okay, volunteer for the first one. All right. Thank you so much. <laughs> you, Vero? Yes. Okay. The first one is... What's the best way to see the city? How can transform it into a direct way? Go ahead, Berito. Two seconds. How do how do know work? How do know? No. Oops. Oh no. Okay. Raise your hand. Okay. Okay, Ceci, go ahead. Uh uh, could you tell me what the best way the see the see the city is? Uh, no, because you're missing one word. Go ahead. Uh, you, you lost Barito, but but you're still on the game, says you don't worry. Okay, Gabby, what about you? Do you know what the best way to see the city is? Very good. Says you were missing the two. <laughs> but that's okay. Like, ah, very good. Okay, continue. Uh, uh huh. And number three. Very good, Gabby. Where can I rent a bicycle? And Blanky, it's your turn. Uh, 
Do you know where I can rent a bicycle? Very good. Excellent. Okay. <laughs> Liz, how much does a city tour cost? You gotta turn it off your microphone, Liz. She's like, okay, sorry. <laughs> oh my God, turn it off. Okay. <laughs> okay. Do you know um, how much a city tour cost? Uh, 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 the no. Okay, who can answer? Almost, please. Almost, but you're missing something really important. Okay. Uh huh. Wait. Who can answer uh, Liz's questions? Okay, Jaime, go ahead. Do you know how much a city tour costs? Excellent. What happened, Liz? What you forgot? The S, S at, at the, the end. end. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Oh, so we have, okay, Liz, I'm sorry, but I have to say bye to you and also better. Okay, all righty. Very good. I don't know who's going to win, but don't worry. If I, if I don't have enough questions, I can invent. Don't worry. Okay, and number five. Where can I get a student discount on a meal? Eh, Claudito de Enriquez, what about you? Eh, do you know, do you know where can I get a student discount on a meal? No, no, no. who can help? Uh, okay, Ceci, you're still playing. Uh -huh. <laughs> do you know where I can? get a student discount on a meal. Very good. Claudita, yeah. what happened? Yeah, right? Yeah. Opposite, right? I can, can yeah. I, right? <laughs> okay. right. Uh, but you will never forget that. I promise that. Yeah. <laughs> okay, very good. So we don't have, but oh, Claudia and Liz is not, they're not playing anymore. Okay, number five. What time do the museums open? And Elsie. Elsie, if you do not answer, you're going to be out of the game. Sorry. I'm sorry, teacher. I cannot hear. You cannot hear? No. No, it's raining. Ah, would you like me to speak a little bit louder? Like, hello, Alfred. No? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah? Oh, my God. And then I will have a sore throat problem because of you. No, no, can you hear me now? Yeah. I'm, okay, yes. do your do your best. What time do the museums open? Transform it into an indirect question, please. Okay. Uh, do you Number know six. What time? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What time do you know the what time the museums open? Very good. Excellent. Open? Ah, no, no, no. Ah, ha, ha. Eh, no, because you add something that you're not supposed to. Add. Why are you adding the S? Yeah, it's open. No yeah, way. It's ah, it's yeah, open. I know. Mm -hmm. who, can, mm -hmm. who can help yeah. her? Who has the answer? Jaime, Ceci, Edwin, Jose, Beatriz, I don't know, Gabby, Blanquita. Oh. Okay, okay, Edwin, give it a try. Oh, Go Austin? ahead. Teacher, how often? No, no, no. Wait a minute, oh. wait a minute, wait a minute. It's, it's <laughs> Edwin, it's Edwin. Elwin, go ahead. Can you tell me uh, what time the museums open? Aha, uh aha, -huh, uh -huh. it's good, but try to try to pronounce it like in question way, please. Do it again, in question way. Do you, you know? Mm -hmm. Do you know what time the museums open? Uh -huh. The museums, museum, like zzz, like the bee. Can you tell me what time the museums open? Very good. That's what I need. Very good. Okay. You passed because it was something related, not to the structure. It's related to the pronunciation of the question. Okay. So that's good. That's good. Phew, Felwin. Okay. Number seven. Where can I hear live music? And hi, there. Go ahead. Do you know where I can hear live, live music? Very good, but question intonation, please, again. Okay. Uh -huh. Do you know where, can, where I can hear live music? Live music? Live music. Again. 
eyes, he said. <laughs> Do you know where I can hear live music? Uh -huh. Where I can hear live music. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Okay. Jaime has two. Okay. Uh -huh. I'm going to invent right now. Um, hey, uh, where can I get uh, an ATM, guys? Who can transform that sentence? Uh huh. Where can I get an ATM? ATM? Can you tell me where? I can get an ATM. Very good, excellent. Um, how much a cup of coffee costs? How much does a cup of coffee cost? Uh, do you know how much? Uh, how much does the cup? No, no where? Could you repeat the question? No, yeah. I'm not. I'm not going to repeat the question. <laughs> Come on, go. Uh, I, I'm going you, to write it. Okay. Do you know? Uh, no, no, no. You no, know, no. How much does a cup of coffee cost? Ah, I, I. Could you tell me? Uh huh. Uh huh. Could you tell me? Yes, Vero. Could you tell me? Uh huh. The coffee I can. Could you tell me how much? How much the coffee costs? The cup of coffee? The cup of coffee costs? Costs or costs? Thanks God I'm not in front of you. I will be like, like, like this. Right? <laughs> Very good. Excellent. All righty. Uh, what about this one? Um, let me check. I have another one in here. Where can I catch a bus to the city? Where can I catch a bus to the city? Tell me where I can. Uh -huh, Julito, you can do it. You can do it, Julito. Come on. Uh, tell me where I can uh, bus. Ah, uh -huh, I cannot hear you right now. Sorry. Okay. Uh, cool. Tell me where I can uh, bus. Uh huh. Could you tell me where I can what? Get a bus. Get a bus. Get a bus. Yes, I, but I, I I used uh another verb. Do you remember which verb I used? Good. So where I can catch. 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 Exactly. Oh, okay. Catch. Yeah. Catch. So use us the same verb. Is is it is, it, is that is a correct way? But use it with catch, please. Catch. Do it again. Do it again, please. Okay. Julito, go ahead. Okay. Could you tell me where I can catch a bus? Very good. In this city? Excellent. City. Okay. okay. Excellent job. So, guys, uh, you're going to do something right now. Um, I don't know when you were like a young, younger, right? Because you're still young. Okay. I don't want to get in trouble. <laughs> No, but you're still John. Yeah. So, but you were a little bit younger. Oh, when you were a kid. Uh, I don't know about you, but I used to play like if I was a reporter, right? Interviewer. And um, it was really fun because I that helps me to get to know my friends a little bit much better. And my friends get to know me a little bit much better as well. So this is what we're going to do. <laughs> we're going to divide it in groups. And um, we're going to interview, guys. Interview us, okay, each other. But I'm gonna send you something that you're going to use to interview the person. So let me just a couple of minutes. Okay. So um, let me check right now. Yes, we're gonna use the questions that we have that I have sent you right now. And this is what I want you to do, guys. Mm -hmm. How many we are right now? 12, right? So that means that we're going to create six group of two. Okay. So this is what I'm going to do. The question that I have sent you right now, we're going to, we're going to use those questions as well. This, there's no need to have any more questions. So what the question that you have right now, guys, I want you to use the Andre questions to interview your classmate about what? About the city? or about the town where your classmate lives, okay? 
That's what I want. So basically it will be like easy peasy queasy, right? Uh, Ceci will interview Elwin and Elwin will interview Ceci, okay? So I'm sorry guys, but this, I'm going to divide your groups. I don't know if, it's, if you're going to be with somebody who you like or somebody who you don't like, but you, ah, okay, I'm sorry about that, okay? <laughs> I'm like, how you say, I'm impartial. <laughs> so I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Liz, if you have to work with Jaime. May I pull it? I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, I'm just teasing you. Okay, so how many girls we have? We have one, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven girls, right? And we have one, two, three, four guys. Okay, so let me double check. Okay, I'm going to divide you. So do you understand what you're going to do, guys? Yes? Do you understand it? Is it clear? Sorry, teacher, but I have a message from the work and I didn't hear you. Ah, okay. No, I'm going, well, I already sent you the questions that we are working right now. Yes, the question that we have transformed into Andre Way. So basically the same questions you're going to use because you're going to interview your classmate. I don't know who you're going to work with, but uh, you, you that uh, or those questions, you need to use it to ask your classmates about the city or the town where she or he lives, okay? Very good, so. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Lucky you. Jaime, you're gonna work with Josue. Edwin, you're gonna work with Gabby Sanchez. Phew. Brandy, you're gonna work with Claudia Lisette. Blanky, you're going to work with Julio. Claudia, you're gonna work, uh, Claudia Cecilia, gonna work with Vero. E and uh, Claudia de Enriquez, you're gonna work with Elsie. Lucky you. All right, please accept the invitation, guys. Bye, 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 bye. En la cirugía que va a hacer la doctora Mesano del paciente del doctor Toledo, así yeah. que ahorita solo la Miss Sánchez está afuera. Please, Josué, accept the invitation. Also, Berito, Claudia, Amber, and uh, check. Sorry. Sir. Yeah, not say that's okay, Claude. Mm -hmm. There you go. So, Berito, you're missing. You need to be with Claudia Cecilia, please. Very good. Excellent. The test that the teacher sent in, in WhatsApp, we have to, I, I guess we have to convert in an indirect question. Okay. Yes, exactly. Yes. What, what we are doing right now, Josue and Jaime, remember mm -hmm. the questions from two to five, I think so, or seven, right? So those questions that I sent you right now, you gotta use it in the Android way. And for example, let me see, let me ask you one question here. Um, okay, for example, the second one. Uh, can you tell me what the best way to see the city is? Remember? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So if, for example, where do you live, Jaime? In Mexicano. Mexicanos. Josue, where do you live? In Santa Ana. In Santa Ana. Ooh, you live so far away between each other, right? So, of course, there are some places in Mexicanos that Josue doesn't know. And vice versa. So basically, if I ask um, Jaime, Jaime, uh, do you know what the best way to see the city is? How are you going to answer that question to me? Okay. Uh -huh, like that way, right? Yeah. And also in, in Santa Ana, hey, what's the best way to see the city is, Josue? Ah, no. Don't come by a bus or by car. The best way is to walk, my dear. Why? And then you continue, right? Like this. That's okay. what I want, okay? Okay, thank you. Okay, cool. No, thank you. Let me double check the other guys. Okay. I'll be right back. Uh-huh. How's it going? I'm not listening to anybody speaking right now. Why? I'm waiting you. Uh, why are you waiting for me? We are waiting for you. 
Why? We are waiting. Why? You have the questions on the WhatsApp group? The same question. Yes, the same. Oh, I decided okay. not to give you more because those are enough. And those are, will help you to talk about your city or your town. For example, Elwin lives in San Miguel, right? Oof. Yes. And Gabby, where do you live? In San Salvador. You see? Totally different places. So if I ask you, can you tell me what the best way to see the city is? You can ask Gabby to Edwin. He said, ah, no. You have to come by bus, not by car, because with bus, you will be like in front of the window watching everything with that, right? Then you, so I just want that you interact and get to know each other, but try to use all the questions, right? All the questions and to know a little bit about the city or the, a bit of it about the town where you live, okay? That's what okay. I want. Okay, let me go okay. back and double check the other guys, okay? I'll be right back. Okay. Huh? How's yes. it going? Um, ah. We were waiting. <laughs> we were waiting. No. <laughs> no, but, but we are, uh -huh. I already asked her. Uh, All the questions. If, no, ah. one. <laughs> but I, I didn't know if uh, we have to. Yeah, improvise you, and yes, of ask course. everything yeah oh, okay you gotta okay. use all the questions for example uh, where do you live Claudi? i live in santa tecla in santa tecla what about you brendita in san jacinto san jacinto totally different ways so let's pretend that a uh, brandy is a sportive girl right and loves to do like going outdoors and everything and we know that in santa tecla there's a good place that you can rent a bicycle Right, so you can say, "Hey, um, can you tell me where I can rent a bicycle in South Tecla, please?" Huh? Yeah. And you say, "Ah, yeah, there's a good place near like uh, Santa Cecilia, for example." And you start talking about that. So you need to like ask the questions in an indirect way, but in yeah. improvise the answer. Okay. 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 So let me go ahead and double check the other guys. I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> Uh huh. Hello. 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 How's everything going so far? Is it good? <laughs> yes. Uh huh. So tell me, which uh, question are you right now? Which question? You gotta we, use all the questions. We talk about the traffic in in our city. The traffic in our city, but it's not part point of the question that is here. Uh, <laughs> Julito, come on. Body influence. <laughs> no. Re remember the question that I sent you in the WhatsApp, guys? The one that we were discussing okay. in the Android way? So what I want you to oh, do okay. is to use them by using it in the Android way to ask each other about the city, the neighborhood, or the town where you live. For example, Julito, do you live in San Miguel right now, right? Is that right? No. No. Where, where are you right now? I live here in El Tutepeque. Sensun Tepeque. Ah, you took the peque. Ah, All right, that is near Mexicanos, right? Mexicanos, right? Okay, what about you, Blanqui? Uh, I live in Soyapango. Oof, so far away. So you can say, for example, let's pretend the first one. Uh, Blanqui, can you tell me what the best way to see the city is? And you uh, said, ah, uh, you got to come by bus, my man. Yeah, and then if you're a sporty one, you can rent a buy. Hey, where can I rent? Where can I rent a buy? Or where I can, right? Do you know by any chance where I can rent a bike? And you see, you gotta use all the questions. You gotta interview each other, all right? And then we're uh, going okay. to discuss. Uh, we have two more minutes. Let me double check the other guys, and then I will come back. Okay. 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 Let me see who's here. Uh -huh. Let me go back here. There you go. Finish. <laughs> Finish. Yeah. Or no. Uh, no. We have a question. Go ahead. Um, the question is, Vero. Uh, um, mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> you can do it. You can do it. Come on. Come on, Ceci. Uh, Better tell me two oh, uh, questions. 
Uh-huh. To question and me, uh, yeah. make the same. No, you can use all the questions. Ah, okay. Mm-hmm. Because I I formulate two questions and mm-hmm. she answered. Ah, okay. And so, so you gotta use all the questions to get to okay. know each other about the city or the town that you lived. One uh, more minute. Yes, go ahead. Uh, the city, the the one the the one here lives. Uh, where she lives, yes. For yes. example, where where uh, where is uh where does uh Veronica live? Uh, she uh, live Tacachico, I know. Tacachico. No, it's no. no pico. Ah, San Juan o Pico. Oh my God. Yeah, I know it's Pico and Chico, but there are two differences. <laughs> okay, very good. What about you, Ceci? I, I live in San Salvador. Ah, you see, totally different. Yeah. So you can ask, for yeah. example, hey, of course you won't be able to rent a bicycle there, right? I don't know. But uh, you can ask, hey, could, do you know, uh, Berito, uh, what is the best way uh, to, to see the city, right? Yeah. Or where... Uh, the best way to see the city is like that, yes. right? Yes. Mm-hmm. And you start talking about that. Cool. Hey, you know what? It's time to return. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Let's go back right now, guys. Let's double check. Whoops. I haven't seen a student going back to the main class. This is unbelievable. <laughs> and they were like, everybody's like, boom, 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 boom. And I was like, okay, who's coming? Who's coming? Oh, that's nice. Okay, guys, tell me, how was the experience? Was it good? Oh, yeah. Good. You get to know yeah, each other good. a little bit much better? Yeah? Yeah. Uh huh. Who fun, worked with, uh, let me check. Who worked with, uh, I don't know, Jaime worked with Josue. I remember that. So tell me, Jaime. Uh, what information you could get from Josue? Well, uh, he told me Josue lives in Santa Ana. He lives in Santa Ana, yeah. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. it's interesting to go to visit Santa Ana. Why? Because uh, there's many places, uh, there are inter- interesting places to visit. For, and, yeah. and how you can visit it? By walking, by taxi, using a car, a bus? Yeah. Using a car. Really? Why? Well, you can see to explore many places, uh, whatever. You can. For example, he told me about the uh, main Central Park. The Central Park, yes. The Central Park, the cathedral. The cathedral. Cathedral and uh-huh. city hall as well. Ah, okay. Let me ask you. Uh, did you, I don't know if you asked him that, but uh, does uh, no? I don't know. Do you know how much a city tour costs there? He told me fifteen dollars. Fifteen dollars, Josue. Yeah. Are you sure? Use the central, the central park. The central ah, ah, okay. If you want to go to other places, of course the price increases, right? Yes, yes, exactly. Ah, 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 ah. Uh, okay, you know what? What about if you're a student? Well, you're not a student anymore, Jaime, so I'm sorry for that. But, well, yes, but English student, I mean, <laughs> but a, a regular student, right? Uh, that's, uh, I don't know if he gave you that information, but where I can get a discount on a meal if you're a student? Uh, you present the ID in the uh-huh. multi cinema. Ah, okay. Mm-hmm. You got a discount. Only that? Only in that place? Mm, I don't remember the other place he told me. Aha, uh-huh, Josue, help him. <laughs> um, yes, yes, I guess the only the only place. <gasps> no, <laughs> only that. But also, it's in San Salvador, right, guys? If you present the ID, right? If you go to the theater, you can get a discount if you're a student. Is that right? Yes, right. Uh huh. And in the buses, no, you don't get a discount if if you get if you present your ID. No. 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 Here, no. Here, no. Here, yes. Uh huh. Here in El Salvador, no, no, any place in the Mexicanos or to just the back, I know. <gasps> no, my goodness. And if you are in the, 
in your golden ages? <laughs> Tercera edad, golden ages. No? Can you get a discount? Yes, you can get a discount. Remember, if you go to like um, aqua parks and something like that, right? To the zoo, right? Yeah, right? Uh huh. Okay, thank you, Jaime. Thank you, Jose. What about, I think it's Gabby. Gabby worked with Edwin, right? Mm -hmm. Did you ask by any chance, Gabby, about the live music? No. No? There's no live music in San Miguel? No? In San Salvador, no? What about museums? No. What about museums? No? No. No museums in San Miguel? No museums in San Salvador. No, I, I don't believe you, Gabby. We have museums here. Which ones? Here. Which ones? Uh huh. Help Gabby, please, because she doesn't know, she doesn't remember the museum here in El Salvador. That's not possible. <laughs> uh -huh. We have a lot of museums here. For example, Ceci? Uh, Mona. Mona. Uh huh. What else? Uh, Marte. Mm -hmm. um, the president, right? The Arma Museum. <laughs> Uh-huh, yes, the guns. <laughs> the guns museum. Uh -huh. Um I think it's in um uh, where, where is it in uh in uh, oh, Berlin, right? Not no? Berlin. Where is it? Uh, uh, I think it's in Ilopango. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. And there is an or, army museum as well, right? Army? Army and uh, mm -hmm. airplane war airplanes <laughs> Ah yes. You're right about that. Try mm -hmm. the museum also. Yeah. The, ar the army is in San Jacinto. In San Jacinto, right? It's the army, right? Uh huh. Yeah, I remember that. I, I remember that there was like a, a graduation party that we were invited. And what I love is that we could get into like the plane and we could, and we could see like the map. That was amazing. Mm -hmm. I love it. Very good. Who else? Let me see the last one. Julito, who do you work with? I live in. No, who did you work with? Con quien trabajaste? I'm sorry, with uh -huh. Blanca Saliva. Blanquita. Okay, so tell me, uh, where does Blanquita live? Blanquita lives in Soyapan. In Soyapango, all righty. So did she let you know, gave you some information about where she lives? Uh, we are we are almost uh, um, co-workers. <laughs> really? No. She works uh, in Syria Center. Really? Also? <laughs> As you? Yes. Uh, but in a different yes. area, right? Yes, in different yes. areas. Uh -huh. I saw good. her in some occasion. I don't remember. I don't have a good memory for for faces, but I remember. I just that's what he said. Him. I don't believe him, but that's okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> so tell me, did did you talk about uh, what is the best? What was the best way to see the city and everything? Or you talk okay, about we... transportation, right? <laughs> I remember no, the best it. way to see the city for us <laughs> is to get a car. A car? Uh, there is so much uh, traffic. There's mm -hmm. so many. There is so much traffic in the city to get that. To, yeah, it's to too much traffic. Yeah, you're right about that. Mm -hmm. Any places that you can visit, like museums or something like that? Any places? Mm -hmm. The volcano, San Salvador. San Salvador volcano. Um, Puerto del Diablo. The um, devil's door. <laughs> the devil's, the devil's door. <laughs> Very good. Yeah, uh, there's some interesting places here. Mm -hmm. And that's it. <laughs> Is it like, mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so guys, <laughs> it was, do you like the, the, the exercises? It helps you with the, with the indirect question, but at the same time to get to know each other a little bit much better. Guys, I had to let you know that I have news for you. And uh, this Thursday, 29, is gonna be our last class before 
the August vacations. Okay, that means that next coming week, we're not gonna see each other until August the 9th, okay? okay? I had to let you know that. I ask today, <laughs> that's what I'm letting you know. So before you go, I will give you good news. Tomorrow, guys, we're going to do a recap about something. So we're gonna play tomorrow, okay? So hopefully you can have like a second device, like a cell phone or something like that. Or because um, if not, you won't be able to play. We're going to play Kahoo. Have you played Kahoo? No? <laughs> hopefully you will love it. But you will love it. I promise that. Okay. Okay, guys, it's time to say goodbye. So hugs and kisses. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night. Good night.